Okay, we're back. And I thought about showing you guys how to extrude along curves. Um, I'm actually not going to do that because it's not the best method for what we're doing here. Um, in the future, I'm sure we'll try that. So I'm going to go ahead and select this object, go to face mode. We are going to extrude um, some of these downward. So control E and go ahead and extrude down. Um, control E again, extrude down again, control E again, extrude down. Um, and what we're going to want to do is we're going to want to actually connect these two. And that's really easy to do. We go select face here, select all of these faces right there. We can just hit this bridge button right there. And then we can give it an extra division. Now it looks pretty bad there. Uh, it's very thick handle. And when we look over here, it's very thin. We could change that. Um, we could also hit the three key on our keyboard and it'll kind of smooth things out there on that object. Um, so it's kind of like a subdivision. We can go one again to see it in kind of a normal view. We could also subdivide this, by the way. It's going to look bad, though. See, it's going to look like a tube. So we wouldn't do that. Um, but with this handle, it definitely makes it look better. I'm not sure I like that right there. I'm really not. Um, but I will name it right here, handle. And I'm going to middle click drag into chest to parent them together. Um, I'll also move it closer right in here like that. Uh, maybe center it a little bit better. And go to this view and kind of really get it looking good. There we go. I will probably come back to that. To be honest, I'm not very happy with it. So um, we need to duplicate it and rotate it around. So control D, rotate. Let's go to channel box and rotate it in the Y 90 or 180 rather. And then we'll move it over to the other side here like that. Okay. So we're getting it. It's not perfect. Um, we can definitely change this later though. I'm not super worried about it. Now we've got a challenge because we need to make sure that this chest rotates open. And right now we did not create it that way. So we've got a little bit of a challenge ahead of us. I'll see you in that next lesson.